I'm from Flint, Michigan. What's good? We back with Admire to Aspire. I got my homie President P with me. In the building. And they say they don't know who he is. Well, check him out. Gotta let them know just in case they forget. Ride with a 40 with a 30 round clip. Get the top push back for that extra shit. West side, east side, south side, north side. Get money on our phones. I sell a shit. Which pussy then got caught. Cr -cr Crossed over and got the telling shit. Got my dope kick. My crib hit. Vice caught me with a couple sticks. PFI that bullshit. When it pop up, I'ma fight the shit. Bro. And in that beef, motherfucker, I don't play the lie. Hell, Mary bullets then run the same play back to the whole house. Drop where you block where you stay. It ain't play it. I don't get two fucks, little nigga. I don't play it if you play me wrong. I'll get you right. I woke me a nigga in the middle. That's your bitch, nigga. That's your bitch, nigga. That's your bitch, nigga. Welcome back, got the dog with me. President P, what's good, my back? What's going on, man? Chilling, relaxing, man. I, I, I'm glad to be here, though. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Took us long enough. Speaking of that, speaking of that, it did take us long enough. Right. And that guy, I, he, he said it like that, like I haven't been. No, it, no, it wasn't your fault. You know what I'm saying? It, was, it most definitely wasn't your fault. You was on yours. You know what I'm saying? I, I slacked. I had a lot of but shit going on. Speaking on it, it's good to be here. I've been seeing a, lot of, seeing a lot of posts that you sent, stuff like. Get with me before I have to turn myself in. Right, 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 right. Before was, was yeah, I got in a little trouble. You know what I'm saying? Police came to the crib. You know what I'm saying? I got caught with a couple of sticks. You know what I'm saying? Let's run these streets, but you know, shit, some of these fools, they like to take the car way out. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know what come with this shit. When you jump off the porch, you know what come with it. So it's up to you and your mind. You know what I'm saying? What you what what you got for this shit? This is you gonna get in and get out. You know, right now, shit, I got some shit going on. So I be straight though. But but with with everything you you got going on outside of that, right, right. as far as musically, how is how is that affecting what you got going? On? I mean, right now, before I you know make all these decisions with the lawyer and everything else, you know what I'm saying? Before I even started even getting into starting the case, you know what I'm saying? And what I'm gonna do is just try to drop as much music and videos and hold them down as much as I can. For if I do gotta go sit down, you know what I'm saying? I can be releasing at least once a month. The single dropping or you know what I'm saying some videos dropping or something like that you know what I'm saying just to keep me in tune with the people still though right. just like I'm still here you know what I'm saying I ain't going nowhere for real so when is it a point where you say this is this is what I want to do and this, right, is, right. this is what's holding me back like I knew when I first wrote my first verse that's what I wanted to do you know what I'm saying but the product of your environment will hold you back anytime you know what I'm saying any given time like the statistics of Flint, what's around here? You know what I'm saying? It was, it, it's always been either it's dope boys or hoopers. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, which way you gonna be? Like, what you gonna do when you come from nothing? You know what I'm saying? Like, so, but then you do got the ones who, who, who do what they supposed to do. They go to work and they do this and they do that. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm never, I could never throw no spit on that. Like, something is wrong with that. You get what I'm saying? But it was like, shit, this is really what I'm around. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm around this 24 hours. All my friends is convicted felons. And, uh, you know what I'm saying? And everything else. Like, I don't have, I don't have a everyday person that I could be like, oh, this is my nigga or this is my homegirl. She graduated from this college and shit. You, you like, think that's needed, though? Like, a, yeah. uh, somebody just to say, let's, let's Yeah, say. like, you are what you hang with. Right. You know what I'm saying? In a lot of in a lot of ways, you are what you hang with. You know what I'm saying? And that's and that's that's crazy, but it's the truth, though. You know what I'm saying? It's that's the what truth. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's what you know. But if I if I was around uh, motherfuckers who had Fortune 500 companies, I'd be damn. I had one too. You know what I'm saying? Like this is what I'm around. So, so with that being said, though, think about how many people seeing singles like I take your bitch take right. off, and they're like, okay, he's still doing this. He's still right, right. Think about how. Common sense isn't as common. Common, right, right, right. Because right. what's common for you isn't common. Common for them, right. So right. can you talk about how you you kind of at a displacement, but you right, right. You still like, striving for something? Like yeah, that that that's where I'm at with it. But I know, I know, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying for a fact that mm -hmm. my music can get me out the situation I'm in. Okay. Cause for one, I ain't lying. I ain't, I ain't being nobody else. I'm not sounding like nobody else. I'm creating original music. I'm just being me. Like I'm not going there like. This my brand, so I gotta, I gotta be, I gotta act my brand. No, I'm, I'm going there on this me, like you know what I'm saying. What you so, see, what so you what, get. What's different than Press Pete and anybody else right now in Flint doing it? 
What's the difference? I mean, you know I mean? Like, not to say it all fucked up, but you know what I'm saying? I mean, you know what I'm saying? It's like a lot of a lot of dudes, like, it's a couple cats out here that's doing music right now. And mm-hmm. you look at them like, you can't, they, they, them, they nice, they hard. You know what I'm saying? But it's a couple, you like, cuz, that's a whole show. That's like, game, you know, like, that's a whole show. Mm-hmm. I can't respect that shit. And our city respecting that type of shit, too. Like, you know a motherfuckers ain't living how they talking. And y'all, y'all already respecting that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, where we came from, it wasn't no... We from the slums of this shit. Flint, period. The slums of this so shit. So let's talk about that right. real quick. If, as far as Flint goes, and, and I, I get what you right, said right. about people respecting people that right, shouldn't right. even be... But as far as Flint goes, where do you think you fall with that? Like, where, where, where are you at? I give myself my own category. But then, like, into that, it's like... I'm to the point now where I'm not even really tripping because of how this how the city treats certain people. Like I'm not even in the midst of trying to get a name out the shit no more because for one, I've been rapping so long and I'm from the crib. Like my name ain't fucked up. I don't do fucked right. up shit around. You know what I'm saying? None of that. So it's like if a motherfucker gonna like me or they ain't. Mm-hmm. A lot of these niggas be mad at me about a bitch though. I ain't gonna lie to you. Like not to say it all vulgar and like just so y'all don't take it the wrong way. But you know what I'm saying? That's where the stuff came from. Yeah, that's like that's what that shit be coming about. Like dog, I don't have no problem with you, bro. Like you know what I'm saying? Okay, you I hit yours, you hit mine. We even. I'm not mad oh, about the shit. Like something like that. How do you? And it's a single. Right, right, right. How do you incorporate incorporate that into a radio single though? Like what do you, yeah, I'll take what do you do? When I when I hear that I think about I think about Jizzle's Molly Molly. Right, 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 right. right. Rough. I love I love Rough. It. I love Rough. It. Oh, they just did first thing out on the radio. Right, 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 right. Tell me you everybody hates it. it like, everybody see, hates it. Like that's what that was. How do you I did that? I did that and I don't let nobody hear it. You know what I'm saying? I don't I don't like it though, cause it's kinda it come from being so powerful and so serious of the I take your bitch like it, it it's basically telling you like when you hear it like I believe he'll take my bitch like even if somebody else was to be in the club rapping it and they saying it you like man I believe that nigga you know what I'm saying or even if she's saying it you like I believe well, her you want to push his single though yeah like, I, t- to- I got that I take your chick and it's it's Oh, that's what it'll be. I yeah, take like I take your chick player, it but it's don't. just like it don't see. It. You know what I'm saying? I feel like it's gonna be one of them like for uh, online radios, and mm-hmm. Shade Four Five, and all that. You know what I'm saying? So what's, Internet. What's the next single? Is it something that pull can up, be radio play? Pull up, pull up, most definitely pull up, pull up, most definitely got radio, radio play. play. It's gonna be radio play. I swear, it's gonna be radio <laughs> play. It's gonna be radio play. It's it's some vulgar shit in it. Don't get it wrong, but you know. It's a couple words to switch out, but with the I take your chick coming from I take your bitch nigga to I take take your chick player. You know what I'm saying? Like getting hit by a real player. And like that music takes something to the mental with certain people who listen to it. Like I done listen to some music and be like, shit, I'm finna go get some money off this shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> listen to some music like fuck it, them niggas tripping, it is what it is, you know what I'm saying? But music is real influential. So you gotta be watching and, and, and what's going on now in our culture and the day and age, 2017, you know what I'm saying, 16, 15, how all of that shit switch. These kids listen to this shit. Yeah. And they out here tripping off that shit. They doing some wild shit off that shit. You know what I'm saying? You looking at little nigga 16 to 25, you looking but at you them like the nicest either though. No, I ain't. You know what I'm saying? I ain't. And it, that's what got me thinking like that. You know what I'm saying? Logical mm-hmm. thinking is like. I'm telling y'all this shit, mm-hmm. but this is where I come from. This is where, you know what I'm saying? This is where you can sound. Yeah, I'm not saying go do this shit, though, you right, know what I'm saying? Right, but right, right. listening to music, that's what it make you do, though. You yeah, know what I'm saying? But when I, 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 when I hear things like that, I think about the Double XL video with uh, Don Tripp, and they were talking right. about how influential was music. He said, uh, he said, yeah, I rap about my life, but this is what I've been through. Right, right, right. Kids don't watch Transformers and think that Mom's Camaro is going to turn into something different. Right, that's true. That's true. That's very true. But back to the famous quote, even you said it, I didn't heard it. Clifton said it, I didn't heard it. The OG said it. Like, sometimes common sense ain't that common. You know what I'm saying? They be looking at it like, damn, you said it? I'm going to go do that. I want all the bricks. I want all the guns. I want to kill everybody. I want to shoot motherfuckers. I want to take these pills. I want to take, you know what I'm saying? And they thinking like, no, nah, that's not what it is. Yeah, yeah. Especially if you ain't got no strong mind for it. You know what I'm saying? In, in, in this place. I want to call it the flame right there because I do feel like it's different. Right. I do think we are our own category separate right. from any city, anybody else doing it. Who do you, I don't want to say who do you mess with the most, but I, I feel like you got certain people who right, right. who get a lot of features. Like, right, right, right. Their name is called Anytime a Feature. Right, right, right. But who do you click with when it comes to that? I mean, I ain't going to lie to you. Like, I had to, I had to stop, stop 
and cut it off with Vontae Gray. Like, I mean, him, what it is, like, that's my man. I've been knowing him for a long time, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, his brother, my brother was cool. <laughs> and I'm talking, we got to the point, we got to making so many fucking songs together. Uh, it was <laughs> like, we can't make no more songs, bro. We got to chill for a minute. Like, we got to come back in it, you know what I'm saying? Like, no matter what, like, not just somebody yeah, just, just like, just off the we going in there because he working, I'm working, you know what I'm saying? He helping, I'm helping, you know what I'm saying? We on the same shit, we just got the vibe for it. What, but what was the last collab? Yeah? Me and him, long way. Man, where can we stop? Cause shit, I got shit in hard drives that motherfuckers never heard. You know what I'm saying? Like, what was the last collab you had throughout the artist? Was it the uh, the last one? Me and Louis Ray just did. Some, me and Louis Ray just did some shit. You know what oh, I'm saying? Yeah, we, me and him just okay, did okay, some okay, shit. Okay, okay, you know okay. what I'm saying? But the last collab where everybody heard and saw videos and shit was with Louis two and them though, with the mob remix. What, what did that feel like? Even recording it and then. How did recording feel like? Let's go there first. How like, did recording? Now? It felt good though. We all was in the crib. We well, got to work. It was in like. Who, who did you hear first? Or were y'all in there together? Like we was in there together. Oh, everybody. Everybody was there together. You know what I'm so saying? So what like, was that like? like, like it was cool. Everybody was really just in their own zone with like, nobody I'm in there. Thinking like some busy bones. Yeah, like bars, we just in here chilling, busy, kicking you know? it, talking shit, drinking, smoking. You know what I'm saying? And getting For to real. it. And it wasn't no. It was never no egos mm -hmm. in the room and no like. Okay, this presidential, he might be like the older cat in so the music. Yeah, right then. Like, right. let's get to it. That's cool. Like, let's get to it right now and let's, let's go on drop. You know what I'm saying? Especially when that, that verse came about because I was finna do some other shit to the song. Mm -hmm. I'm like, shit, I just got out of jail from getting got in trouble. Got, I'm like, got, shit, got, got, got. fuck that. I'm finna got. talk about what's going on real quick. You know what I'm saying? But everybody did their thing. When you did the, the video, what, what, what's that yeah. like? How, how recent was it? Cause I feel like, I, I, like I, I didn't hear the song until right, the video right. came out. That was like when we shot that video. I mean, shot did the song. It was probably like a couple weeks later. Motherfuckers got to the video. It was like motherfuckers was really on it. Like let's go. Oh, for real? You know what I'm saying? Like let's go. But when I heard them, like that was and that was an experience for me because that was the first time me ever. Like I heard of him, but never like was in his presence and nothing with twice. Mm -hmm. So that was the first time I heard him, and I'm like, dog hard. Oh, like, twice, man, like dog hard. You know what I'm saying? I've like been he trying hard. to get twice in here. I've been, I've been trying to get him in here uh -huh. so bad. I've been talking to him. Yeah, come on, man, you tripping? You know what I'm saying? You tripping? Come on. It's like, with the, like even with the top. rest of them. I just felt like I had to speak on twice name because like he was the younger one. That's the one I didn't really know then. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Everybody else, they named Stamp. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers been doing what they was doing. You know what I'm saying? But that was just experience for me to just work with him. But it was also experience that we all worked together on that same record because I didn't have no records with me and just just me and Zeke. Yeah. Me and Zeke did the um, mix with Cassius though. Don't play that. It was on okay, that. Yeah, 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 you know what I'm saying? So we did that, but it was like, okay, it's, it's me, Louis, it's Twice, Valley. You know what I'm saying? We on this bitch, we, it's crazy. Let's talk about the chemistry with you and O. Uh, uh, right, right. And I, I bring that up because I was able to record right, the right. uh, Spring Jam, 2K17, right, right. Jacquees, and and I, I just think the antics of, of, of play that shit again. Right. Let's do that shit again. This, like, that's I, that's my brother. You know what I'm saying? Like that's my brother. Like I can't take nothing from. Like we fight like brothers. We argue like brothers. You know what I'm saying? We cuss each other out like brothers. So it's like when it come to that shit. I'm motherfucker thinking how I'm thinking, and I'm thinking how he thinking Was with it. it you know what I'm saying? No, it's like ever since the first time we ever did a show together. I'm like, this motherfucker, do he know me? You know what I'm saying? Like, it fucked me up, like mentally. Like, do this nigga really know me or something though? Because we just vibe right then. I said, oh yeah, I'm locked in. It's over. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm locked in. You locked in. Like, can't so shit stop that shit. With bro. the with the with the Spring Jam 17, what was he telling you before I take your bitch came on? It was, and it he was, was saying, he was saying some crazy shit. Ain't no telling though, cause he just said he say a lot of shit though. I, I, you know what I, I just seen you stop and said you gonna you gonna play you gonna play it like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like you, and if we be on that shit, cause he'd be like, hold on, P. He'd be like, hold on. I'm finna do my thing. <laughs> and you like, bro, it's my show. But I'm like, shit, it's really anticipating the crowd more. What so it's like, made you incorporate industry music in. Like, because you wanna, you know, for one, a 10 minute set long, a 15 minute set long, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? So some of the people who, in them crowds, when you got large crowds like that, you wanna turn them back up because they might not know the music you're doing like that, you know what I'm saying? So you might wanna turn them back up and just give them a piece of you though, you know what I'm saying? Give them a piece of you, turn up, do the food. I'm, I'm, I'm an artist, but at that same time, I'm an entertainer. So I'd rather come out there and fool and turn up and have fun with y'all. Entertainers, people like Kevin Gates. Right. Know? Then hit somebody. Yeah, he didn't man. play. He did in the floor. Yeah. You know, people like Fifty Cent and hit somebody. Yeah. What 
happen when I, I was recording. I, I saw right, right. something go. I'm thinking it's a plastic cup going right. on, but I saw you kick it off and then you yeah, specifically like. pointed at my man. What happened? <laughs> I'm performing. I'm getting ready to do I take your bitch. You know what I'm saying? I'm in the midst of this set now. You know what I'm saying? So it's a group of females that's sitting mm -hmm. up in the front of the stage. You know what I'm saying? They got their cameras. They're they getting geeked, geeked and turning yeah. up. So yeah. when I seen that, I get doing a hook. A CD hit my leg. So I'm like, what the fuck? I look down like, yeah, it was a CD. They hit me with my nigga shit. They hit me with Louis Ray shit. So I'm like, damn, what the fuck gonna be this? I was kind of mad that I kicked the CD too, though, because this is my nigga shit. But I got hit with it. I'm pissed. I really want to hit dog in this shit. But I can't be doing that shit all on camera. You know what I'm saying? You a fan. Like, but this is my thing. Like, I have no problem with nobody's sexuality, period. You know what I'm saying? Period. I got family like that. Mm -hmm. But be a fan don't be disrespectful right. you know what i'm saying so what he did he hit me with the cd and once i look down i'm thinking the females were trying to get my attention to come get in their snapchats or something so when i walk over there he all waving and i'm like what you want you know what i'm saying like what you want we ain't on that up here my nigga you know what i'm saying like i'm taking niggas bitch how, how did you get involved with it as far as performing i mean i've been i've been rocking with dingdom for so long you know what i'm saying so, yeah, my manager big dante you know what i'm saying he got parts you know what i'm saying so it was just like it was gonna be when it comes to managing, as far as Flint artists right yeah. now, how does Big Dante play a role in what you got going? Uh, he play a huge role. Like, mm -hmm. yeah, anybody, uh, if I don't reach out to you and talk to you, like, you got to talk to him. You know what I'm saying? Like, so it's cool because, you know, like, sometimes, like, when, let's say if I was just doing this shit by myself. Mm -hmm. Like I'm doing this shit to eat I'm doing this shit to feed my family I'm doing this shit for bills And shit like that too Like this shit a part of everything else is a hustle so But when you, you dealing said your credentials Gotta be there You think your yeah, credentials there? I know they there I've been grinding too long right. You know what I'm saying I've been grinding too long Been knocking on all these doors You know what I'm saying Like no cocky shit I don't, Some people be a actually Running up on me like you be like you. I just be looking at it like Shit you know that nigga Who's around the corner Like you know what I'm saying Like I'm still be on that shit But it's like I ain't running up on the DJs and, and begging them to spend me no more. Like, I, I'm cool and locked in with them. How did you get them. involved with Buffed Up the movie? That was off Big Dante. You know what I'm saying? Oh, manager yeah. again. You know what I'm saying? Salute him. Salute Bula <laughs> Films. You know what I'm saying? Salute so the Buffed Up, every actor in the movie. You know what I'm saying? So, that was off of him. You know what I'm he saying? Just, he just, what, he's done to somewhere? That, no, like they, that? um... They have been doing some other business, you know what I'm saying, as far as like bringing the comedians down here and stuff like that. And they had locked in with them. They end up doing the buffed up premiere here at the McCree. Oh, so okay. that was all through Dante doing what they was doing. So, you know, it was rough. Basically, like, with this shit, it's not what you know, who you know, you know what I'm saying? So it plugged me in like that, you know what I'm saying? And I was trying to get on the rest of that shit too. Everything <laughs> else they drop. Like, bring it on in, you know what I'm saying? Who else can we take from here to go, you know what I'm saying? I'm with that shit. Favorite? I don't want to say favorite. Top five right now, Flint artist. Presidential feet, presidential feet, presidential feet, presidential feet. No, dude, shit, no. It'd be like shit. You know, you know. I'm, of course, I'm gonna throw myself there. You know what I'm saying? Presidential P. You got Louis Ray. You got Jizzle. You got motherfucking uh, Tierra Centoy doing her thing. You got Jice. Man, I, it's it's too many to name for real, bro. Like I can keep going. I can't just use a top five because I'm really <laughs> liking what everybody doing right now. Like you know what I'm saying? You got you, you still got to get into the, the Daytuan love. You still got to get into Kurt Green. You know what I'm saying? Like it's 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 a lot of shit going on. So I'm talking about from R&B. Flint from other artists right now because I I'm, I'm as a writer, Flint, like you said you got Flint as a whole. Paper. We hired anybody in the United States, bro. Say that. I swear to God, and I mean that shit. I stand on that shit. <laughs> I'm talking about from everything. I'm talking about from rap, R&B, motherfucking pop music. You know what I'm saying? Like that little crazy shit they do at the machine shop. I'm talking about like, motherfuckers is rough. Look where we come from. Motherfuckers is just being them. You know what I'm saying? A lot of these motherfuckers got images, bro. Coming up, who do we look up to as far as... And I, 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 and I, I always, when I say this, I right. always say Flint artists because... Shit, everybody looked up to Big. Right. Everybody looked up to Big. Everybody right. looked When up I came up, I was looking up at like Bree and them, bro. Like, yeah, I was I was on that type of shit yeah. like breeding them like nigga dating family like you know what I'm saying shit like that like the OGs from this bitch Eshan and shit listening to all that type of shit you know what I'm saying like what's close to me you know what I'm saying mm -hmm. like 
that's what I really was most definitely in the straight up like how, how dating family top authority all that shit too with that being said though if, coming straight out of homes to job court somebody right now who, who had a music who wanted to start a music career who wanted to start a business who wanted to you feel me just, just be right. better than what they was just right right before. right what would be the words you would look them in the eye and tell them be serious invest in self Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, what you say you're going to do with this shit, do that. Mm -hmm. Execute that shit. Come up with your plan, plot, and go from there. You know what I'm saying? Like, and, and, and read more. Because my whole time of doing this shit, bro, I didn't know nothing about none of this. I thought I was just supposed to rap. Mm -hmm. Like, just go make music. Right. And you're going to go from there. You know what I'm saying? I didn't know it was 90% business, 10% music. You know what I'm saying? 80, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah. yeah. That's when you got to take it, get to take it seriously. Lately, while I've been sitting back and people been like, no, he ain't been dropping music. He ain't been, mm. no, we've been getting paperwork together, though. Okay. The paperwork straight, streaming, you know what I'm saying? Getting on okay. that type of shit, okay. you know what I'm saying? Like, because my first eight years and 10 years doing this shit, I was like, man, shit, I'm just. Is it another single we should be waiting for? Another video? Man, look, or another. I ain't even want to say it, but we got anything. You know what I'm saying? We got anything. anything you know what I'm saying? We got anything we working on and shit. I just yeah. dropped a track with Kurt and uh, Rich Neff that is it's self titled. It don't even have a name right now. You okay. know what I'm saying? That okay. I, that I'm working on too. So I'm probably gonna end up dropping that, and then I'm gonna see what Louis talking about with that shit we did, and go from oh, there. So you know what I'm saying? Still got the Louis project. I mean, yeah, yeah. Like shit wasn't even. You know what I'm saying? It, it's it's other shit, bro. Like it ain't it ain't just okay. Damn. He study posting on the net. He study mm -hmm. he study performing this and that. Mm -hmm. And they no, that's other shit. But well, we just gotta get this shit together first. <laughs> you know yeah, the paperwork gotta be right. The paperwork, paperwork gotta be right, man. Is there anything else that you, that you wanted to say or anything else? Yeah, you pull up, drop it. We gonna do that shit Memorial Memorial Day weekend. Where they can find you, man? Man, iTunes, Spotify, Google Play, like you know what I'm saying? Everywhere, like everywhere. That's where the paperwork came in. <laughs> Before that, it was straight YouTube, SoundCloud, okay. that piff. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be on all of that too. You know what I'm saying? Audio Max, every, anywhere where they can stream music. Okay. That's where it's at. Every platform, period. I, yeah. I just have to. I mean, I'd be stupid not to ask. But do we got some bars? We talking about? I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where where I wanna go with this shit? Do now? we? Where do I wanna go with this shit, man? Where do I wanna go with this shit? Can now? we bless A2I with something? Yeah, man. Where where can I go with this shit? Niggas be talking like they got the shit. I fuck with them niggas who move in the bricks. Niggas be talking like they really shooters in me and my niggas be killing some shit. Any nigga sneak this and pee. That'll get your whole hit in the back of the whip. In the club, bitch, I'm VIP. And I never lack cause I keep a stick. Remember serving off a gang scale. When they got home, it was a 2-6. Niggas talking about fucking hoes. Nigga, that ain't no new shit. 30 rounds on a glue stick. And they tackle niggas like a hit stick. Let me stop this shit, man. <laughs> oh one man, you hear me? What did Flex say? Everybody can't come here. Uh, Bless you from Flint. Uh, nigga, you feel me? This your boy Prime and mine to inspire. Walking I got out. my baby presidential pin with me. in the building, you hear me? 387, man. Y'all know what's up, man.